spring is here and I'm so excited. The weather is just gorgeous at the moment. Um, that's why we had to film outside, just because it's so beautiful, isn't it? We've been sitting out here every day by the pool, just relaxing, getting the vitamin D and just loving it. So I'm so excited to do a beautiful spring makeover in my home. It's time to put away all the cozy, beautiful winter items and put them away and refresh the house and just do little small changes that can actually really change the feel of your home. Um, if you, I'll link my video just up here for the winter makeover videos that I did. Um, so a lot of those things are sort of going to be swapping out and doing something different just to make the home feel fresh and new. I know um, being in lockdown at the moment, everyone's wanting to do a lot of work on their homes and we're no different. So um, yeah, I just want to go through the items that we've got. We actually went shopping at Kmart, Target, BW, Maya, Bunnings. <laughs> we've covered all the bases. So it will be a probably, I would say, maybe around a three part series. Um, Australia Post has definitely been a bit delayed in their deliveries because their poor things have been inundated <laughs> and uh, we're definitely adding to that. So I do have a lot of things coming still from Kmart we, and um, you'll, you'll probably notice there's some things here that we, we're getting for Father's Day and they came after Father's Day. So it is a little bit crazy. The Click and Collect is amazing at all of the stores. Uh, but definitely anything that's coming via the post, it can be delayed up to two weeks. I've actually got some items that still haven't arrived and it's been three weeks. So anyway, we're getting there. We're getting some items. So they will cut as they come in, I'll do little videos and update you all. So, please don't mind any of the noise in the background just because everyone's in lockdown and everyone's home and everyone's making noise. So we thought we've been waiting actually quite a few hours today already and it's just time to get this done. So please bear with us. So I have my wonderful little assistant here that's going to help me. He, we've, um, he's going to help pass me the items. So do you want to get the first one? Okay, so first up, I wanted to change the bedding in my bedroom. I will show you, here is the before of our bedroom. And I definitely wanted to change things up. We had it really beautiful for winter. I love white bed linen. I do usually have white bed linen, but this time, because it's spring, I just really wanted to add that touch of floral to the room. Um, so I looked in all the stores. They, they do have some really beautiful, colourful floral um, bedspreads, but I was just looking for something that was still not too far from my normal style. And this one I found at Target and it was only $35 and I have to say, it actually feels like nice quality. So, this is it. For $35, um, you get the so it's the quilt and the two pillow cases. The navy and white is so fresh and I just think that adding the floral in is just a perfect thing for springtime. I was looking for something pink and I was looking for something like all my sort of favorite colors or something aqua, but I definitely searched high and low and couldn't find anything that was sort of screaming that spring vibe for me. I have done the sort of, um, the chenille style bedding quite a lot. So I wanted to get something that was just different and clean and fresh and I just think that this is really pretty so I'm going navy and white in the bedroom and um, yeah really happy with this little find. Then next up to go with the bedding um, I do have three um, European pillows across the back of my bed I've got a super king bed to go with my new bedding I wanted to have some pillowcases to go with it they didn't have anything that was in, in that exact style so I just went safe and went with white as that is what I normally have anyway and it will go with all my other bedding as well. This is the Arlo Stonewashed European pillowcase um, and then I also got a couple of extra just the normal standard pillows as well um, just because I have lots of pillows on my bed. <laughs> Now, my husband and I always argue about this particular thing. I like to have a top sheet, but my husband hates it. 
Um, so over the years of us being together for like 20 years, I've given up. <laughs> so we don't use a top sheet, I only use the bottom fitted sheet. Um, he likes to have his feet out and he kicks and kicks around, <laughs> so I have given up on that. Um, so I love that Target actually only, ha you can actually just buy the fitted sheet. So I've got so many normal sheets, especially king size sheets that are just in my cupboard taking up space and we never use them. So. Um, I'm really happy that you can get these by themselves and this is the Arlo Stonewash um, fitted sheet. I was wanting to get a throw to just sort of have on the corner of the bed. Um, I did pick up this one, it's called the Baker Throw and it is from Target. I'll show you the back as well, it's got these pom-poms here. Now I'm not 100% sure I'm going to keep this one. I'll have to see what it looks like. I might just sort of take it out of its packaging and just try it to see what it looks like. Yes, it's just not the quality I was expecting. Um, the colour's perfect. I'm still on the search for another navy throw. Thank you darling. You're such a good helper, thank you. <laughs> Okay, so I wanted to get some navy and white towels that would go into our ensuite and match our bedding in the bedroom. Um, these are actually really quite nice. It's, these ones are from Target and they're called the Canning Vale Love Your Home Hotel Collection and it is a four piece collection. So you get, you get, two, ba yeah, you get two bath towels, a hand towel and also a face washer. So that's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah. And it was actually a really good price as well. I did try to get, they do have a fitted sheet, like a sheet set in the same Canning Vale style um, and it looks like hotel bedding but I did buy it and then Target ended up refunding me before it arrived saying that they had no stock. Um, so I will keep looking out for those sheets. If you have bought those sheets, I'd love to know what you think of those. If you think that they're good, please comment down below and let us know if you like those. Um, as they do look really beautiful and they look like they've got that hotel vibe which is gorgeous um, but these I'll have to see um, but I really like the navy and white stripe and it will go perfect with the bedding they look nice <laughs> they do don't they? Yeah. they feel nice what do you think? I feel like they feel really soft yeah I don't, know, I don't know if that's how I feel <laughs> <laughs> you know when we go to a hotel yeah. They feel pretty good. They're not like Sheridan towels, but they're still nice. So I have purchased a couple of um, napkin rings from Target. I do have, they do have this really beautiful white rattan one, which is coming, it's actually being shipped to a store closer to me at this, as we speak. Um, but this one did arrive in my click and collect and it is called the, is it Acacia Wood? Acacia. 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 See? This brain over here. <laughs> what was it called? Acacia Wood napkin ring. I need him to do the pronunciation for me. <laughs> uh, so they are wooden napkin rings. So I am still going to do my um, dining room video for you. I did put it off for a couple of weeks because we've been in lockdown and I thought not like many people are having anyone over to their homes. Um, but in a couple of weeks time, it looks like things might be starting to change. So I will do um, the dining room with all those beautiful Kmart and Target items. I've got them all sitting in my dining room ready to do the video. Um, and I, these little added extras are gonna be fantastic to, to be the finishing products for those. So that will be coming up soon. But yeah, perfect. Okay, so I do wanna get some new glasses as, I don't know what my husband does with them, but I'm sure there's probably 10 in the garage and I just can't find them. <laughs> just seem to disappear. But I did pick up an extra um, box of these glasses as I really love the size of these glasses. I just thought I'd show you because we do have both of them here. So this is the what this is what this one here looks like. I just love the size of this, but this is my actual favourite one at Kmart. But they are that little bit smaller, and you just sort of I feel like I drink this really fast, <laughs> and um, I've got to you know constantly refill with this one. But but I really love how they look. I have crystal glasses and honestly, these look just as good. You can't really tell the difference, which is pretty scary seeming I spent an absolute fortune on Natchem crystal glasses. <laughs> um, and they're really strong too, where the crystal ones that I have have all got little chips and oh, I, don't, I don't even want to start on that, it drives me crazy. But for everyday use, these are fantastic. Yeah, I just wanted to show you what they look like out of the box. Next thing I picked up was the Badge Smoothie Jar Set. 
Um, as we've been sitting out by the pool every day, especially my son and I, he's doing his homeschooling and I'm just chilling. <laughs> um, these are fantastic. So this is another bigger, this is the size of it here. Basically, oh, you can see it there. I love to put ice and strawberries and cucumbers and lemon in, in my drink. And the straw is just so handy. I really go through these. I find it easy to drink, especially with the added flavor as well. It's really nice. It's good, isn't it? <laughs> he loves it. <laughs> and then you also get, you get two lids. So you get the lid without the hole in it. You can use it as a jar or you can have it like a drink holder. So this is amazing. We love these. <laughs> mm. They're super cheap, perfect size to get lots of water in for summertime. They're unreal. I love these. Pretty. Yeah, they do, don't they? Yeah. They have all that, that grip. Like that yeah. Grip. No, they're really nice. I think it's supposed to hold your grip. Yeah. So next up is a new hat. Yes. <laughs> um, it was $9. I really love the little stripe. I think it looks really cute. Um, like I said, we've been sitting out in the pool and going for beach walks, and I just really like to cover my face and not get too much sun on my face or my neck or my chest yeah, it's very comfortable. and it's very comfortable let's see what mummy looks like in it because I haven't tried this on yet there's your little tag oh, the little oh. <laughs> there's the tag it's only nine dollars they're one size what do you think cowboy <laughs> <laughs> is it a cowboy huh <laughs> very cute there we go I want to wear this for the rest of the No, not for the rest. Well, for the spot until we get to the second part. Okay. Then I've done some shopping over at Big W and they've got so many beautiful things. But I was looking for candlesticks, um, well, the candlesticks, especially in a three set. I looked everywhere and the pricing honestly can be hundreds of dollars for something that looks exactly the same as this too, mind you. It really doesn't... Um, not that it, it looks any different to this, but these are beautiful. I love these. These are fantastic. I'm going to show you all of these items in my makeover videos, which will be coming up very in the next couple of weeks. So you'll see everything um, out of the box. <laughs> Otherwise, we'll be here all day. <laughs> okay, so I did get some beautiful wrapping paper for Father's Day, but unfortunately came out, let the team down. <laughs> well, maybe not came out, but Australia Post did. Um, and this arrived only this week when Father's Day was last weekend, the weekend before. I can't even remember. Everything's just like going into one now. What day is it? Oh, it was last weekend. <laughs> uh, so we had to end up going out again to try and find um, to try and find wrapping paper. But this is actually really beautiful, and it wasn't very expensive. You can see the pattern there. And luckily, because it's such a cool pattern, we'll be able to use this for lots of other presents. So I also got this from um, Big W as well, and it's a candle care kit. It has a candle snuffer, it's called, and a wick trimmer in it. So it is closed, Let's just so I can show you. Fancy. I know. I, know, I don't actually have one of these. So this, you can see, you can get down into your candle and, and without hurting yourself, you can trim the wicks. So it's like a little scissors. And then, and I love that it's gold. You know, that's right up my alley. Mm -hmm. And then when you want to put your candle out, you've got, you just put that over the top of the candle and, and it goes out. So you don't have to blow it because I did do that on our beautiful, um, I did blow out a candle on our beautiful dining table, which is marble and the candle wax went all over it, didn't it? Mm -hmm. I'm still trying to get that off. If anyone knows how to get candle wax off a beautiful, and it's just like little tiny drops of candle wax um, on and off marble, please let me know because I'm so scared I'm going to scratch the table. So I'm still in the works of trying to work out how to fix the table. But that was just from going, which is one of the main reasons why I bought this. <laughs> Okay. I went to Bunnings. I've been buying lots and lots of things from Bunnings. This plant is actually one here and I did get it luckily on the uh, clearance table and instead of it being nearly $60 it was down to $30. So always check out their little clearance section because 
if you take good care of the plants, you'll bring them back to life and it really wasn't that damaged. So I'm really, really happy with that bargain. But I also went past and I'm in the process of changing all of my hangers to these particular hangers. I love the velvet ones. I love that I can have a, you know, a little cami on here and it won't slide off. Um, and <laughs> you don't like them, do you? Really? <laughs> I don't like this I just like the feel of it. If you don't like the feel of velvet, then you will not like these. Um, but I love them. And at, uh, but these are around the three dollar mark for a pack of ten. So I grabbed a, quite a few of these. It's like less than a cup of coffee to do lots of um, to hang lots of your clothes on. <laughs> okay, so this is what we got, Daddy, for Father's Day. Yeah. <laughs> he is um, he's at work at the moment, so we thought that we would show you what we got him. Um, as we've been having lots of fire pits, so if you want to show them, we've got our fire pit, which is also from Bunnings down there as well. Um, we've been having those all the time. And yeah, so he did, he needed to have a little chainsaw to just cut wood, and um, so we can use it for that, and then also just for tree trimming and that type of thing around the home. So I got him this one here, and it's really good. He loves it, and um, it was a bargain. I think it was like ninety nine dollars from Bunnings. Okay, and then I also grabbed this when I was at Bunnings as well. I just love the little rattan. It's a little plant stand, or a little, um, there we go. That's what it looks like. So you can put your plants in a little plant holder, pot holder, plant pot holder. <laughs> I think that's what you call it. What do you call it? A pot plant hold. stand is what it's called. Plant it's stand. So you put your plant in there and it sits in there. So I just thought that was really cute. I just happened to stumble along it when I picked up this plant actually. And um, we do have a lot of plants to show you, but I will show you that in next week's haul, we've got, we're going to be doing up our vegetable garden. And aren't we, love that. So we've got so much more to show you next week. I've got so many things from Kmart, again, Target, Big W and Bunnings, and I will go through your diet. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you so much for watching the video today i really appreciate it i do apologize for the background noise but like i said it's just so beautiful outside we really wanted to do the video out here and please check out my instagram as i'll have all the detailed photos of everything over there and check out the description box below as i will have all the items linked down there if you want to buy any of these items um, please let me know what you think what was your favorite items um, I'll meet you down in the comments. I'd love to hear from you. We love the comments, yeah. don't we? We love hearing from you all. And um, and please subscribe. Yes. We, we're, we're so such a small little channel. If you do enjoy my videos, I would love for you to join our little family and tribe that's here on YouTube. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your busy day to um, spend time with us. And we really appreciate it. So look out for next week's video. So much coming up. All the... Um, another huge haul and I can't wait for you to see it. Actually, before I go, I will add in the drink of the week. Um, it is a margarita that's coming up next. <laughs> Are you crying? Are you crying? Oh. Okay, so I have my little assistant here today to help me. How are you, Teddy? He's had a haircut, he's looking all fresh for spring got my little it's a bit of a cool day today but I had to have something that was a bit more springtime on but we're gonna make we're gonna make <laughs> Good boy. we're going to make margaritas margaritas oh he's very excited margarita about the margarita time. margarita time he's very excited for the margaritas if I'm going out to a restaurant, I either get a champagne or a margarita. Usually I always start my night on a margarita. So when I went to Aldi, they actually had blood oranges there and on special. So I thought I'd get these and make a blood orange margarita instead of the normal traditional lime one. They actually make these at my work, so I should be okay at making these ones. <laughs> He's very wiggly. He's very wiggly. Okay, so what we need is a, um, a shaker with ice in it. I've got our blood orange juice, which is freshly squeezed. I've also cut up some blood oranges to use as garnish. 
And then I've got my tagine or tahine, I think that's how you say it. And I'm going to line the glass with that. Then I've got this, uh, it's a triple sec. And also the Patron tequila. And that's our blood oranges there. So aren't these beautiful as well? My little boy, or my husband and my little boy went off to the, um, to the shops and came back with these. I'll insert the footage here of my little boy giving them to me. I was like, oh. We want a full shot of um, tequila, half a shot of the triple sec, and then do the rest with your, <laughs> depending on how strong you like it. Is that what you, how do you like it, Teddy? Do you like it like that? <laughs> and depending on how you like it, you can either make it stronger or weaker, but that's where I'm going to start. So let's do the important stuff first. This, this is a beautiful tequila as well. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we'll do one shot of tequila. Is that cool, Teddy Bear? No. Teddy! You oh. watching? Oh, you don't know. This is so cool. Oh, this one's stuck in. Oh. Oh, there <laughs> we go. There. Okay, and then we just do a little puffy of the triple sec, which is like an orange flavour. I'm just going to pour this directly in as I'm scared. <laughs> I'm probably doing about an equal amount, an equal, so a shot and a half of the actual juice that you want to use. So you can use lime juice, you can use lemon, you can use orange, normal oranges, or the blood oranges, which is really nice. I'm also going to garnish my glass with a little piece of blood orange, which is just such a beautiful colour that red in there. I love it. And when we were juicing, you can see the colour there. It's just gorgeous. Oh, you've got so much to say today. He's singing. He's singing for our audience. Oh, he's shaking his little tail too. He's shaking as well. He's shaking. He's shaking. He's shaking. He's shaking. He's very excited today. He's very happy he's helping mum. Okay, here we go. We're going to push it. Pour it out. There we go. Is that cool, Teddy Bear? Now this glass here I did get from Kmart from last Christmas. I love them when they bring out their Christmas stuff to decorate your tables. Every year, actually it might have been two years ago, I think last year they had the gold and then um, I get the whole set. So I can't wait to see what they bring out soon. Christmas is not too far away. I love Christmas and I can't wait to make the Christmas content. But <laughs> let's see what this tastes like. It's perfect, absolutely perfect. So that's the blood orange drink. Penny, come here. Thank you. Yeah, mum, 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 mum. Okay, ready? What are you gonna say? And the and the drink of the and the drink of the week. <laughs> He's speaking! And the drink of the week is the blood orange margarita! He's very talkative today. It's because you're on camera. Oh, that's so good. Teddy bear. Mm. And that tahini that just makes it really good. If you don't have this, you can just use normal salt. But I love this stuff. I got that on eBay too. Okay, that's the drink of the week. 
<laughs> Thanks, guys. Bye. And we feel very excited because we're going it's like going on a date when you're in lockdown to go and do click and collect and go to Bunnings <laughs> absolute bargain I've got like lipstick all in my lip gloss how you said there's lipstick in my lip gloss uh, I will show you all of these items um, when I do my I will show you all of these items when I do my haul video um, not my haul. <laughs> because um, I did A two, this is going to be a two. Um, I have a <laughs> worth it. Margarita time. Okay. So sit down. Sit careful, down. careful. Sit, sit. Okay. So I am a massive fan. Okay, come on, finger boy. I'm a massive fan of margaritas. <laughs> I'm a massive fan of margaritas and. <laughs> Let me hold it up a bit higher. I'm a, it's a candlestick hair. Oh, sorry, a candle. <laughs> this is very bumpy. Okay, so I wanted to get some navy and white. Um, I actually wanted to get some navy and white uh, towels to go in my en suite. So I wanted to actually get some navy towels that could go into my en suite. <laughs> That's not navy. <laughs> That's what it's called, the little bathroom next to you. Okay, start again. But, um... <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> and yeah, I just um, don't know what to say. <laughs> <laughs> and um yeah thank you so much for taking the time out of your life. very excited to be getting out of the house even just for a little while to go and pick these things up take care guys we love you bye come up closer with them bye, bye. <laughs> oh my god join our family please like and subscribe <laughs> join our waffles one two three Join our family! Please like and subscribe! Thanks for watching!